After my death, my mother cried for days and died of heartbreak. Calling you. Oh, Papa. Well, don't worry, I'm after you. Are you sure you're okay? Yes. I'm after you. that are not getting any younger. Papa, you have started again. Not about starting again. Obina, you are my only son. I want you to get married and marry in time. After all, you have finished your university education since last year. And I'll come back to the village. Please get married. Papa, Papa, Please. I will get married. I will get married at the right time. Uh, this is not just the right time for me. The right time? Which time is the right time? Obinda, before I will join my ancestors, I want to carry my grandchildren. You will. You will carry your grandchildren at the right time. After all, this is the last of my wishes for you children. Do it for me. Do it for me. It's Let fine, me have Papa. peace. It's fine, Papa. I've heard you. I've heard you. Are, are you done? Right. Is there something else you, you want? Why is your face like this? What is it? Is it not Papa? Do you know since I got back from school, Papa has been disturbing me. What did he say to you? That he wants me to get married and uh, so he can be able to carry his grandchildren. But Obina, you know what Papa is saying is the truth. Eh? You're the only son. Papa is also the only son. Do you want his nene to close? Please look for a decent girl in this village and get married to her. Obina, what Ojo is saying is the truth. You need to get a woman and get married. Maybe I should just stop all this now. Stop this thing now. Uh -huh. Are you full supporting Papa? Before Uncle, are you not the only son? You guys are not even serious. I, I, I thought coming here was going to make me feel a lot better. Hey. Just making things worse for me. Obina! Leave him. Leave him. Very soon. You will know that to be an only son is not easy. Help me. How can I put your anything? Are you not seeing the sound? See the sound that's going. I'm walking around this way. Don't know if I know this. Baby, oh. what 
to do it. <sighs> Babe is my father. He has been on my neck. I mean, he wants me to get married. Um, but you know you are the only son. Why not marry and settle down? Babe, it's not about getting married and settling down. Are you ready to be a wife? Of course I'm ready, baby. I'm ready. I'm ready. If you're ready, I'm ready. Okay, um, what about the financial aspect of it? You know, money is needed for this, this kind of thing. Baby, have you forgotten your father left his business for you? And his beauties are under your name. So we can start from there. Are, are, you, are you saying that you're ready to settle down? Mm, I'm ready. You are? That's fine. Um, I, um, I will talk to my father and my sisters about it. Mm. Yeah. Okay, happy okay then. You're sure? Yeah. Thank you. Mm? Oh, Uh, my friend, what did you tell me? That I'm ready, of course. That's my girl. You know his father left a lot of property for him. So being his wife will make you comfortable. <laughs> you know how much I love Obina. I love him so much. Mm -hmm. I can't trend him for anything. Uh, Shai, my dear, hold your man tight to These small girls of this our generation, they know they smile. Huh? Eh? <laughs> Any girl I see around Obina, I will deal with that person. Because Obina is my and my alone. Yes. Huh. My dear, this call for celebration. Please come and buy me a drink, Jare. Okay, let's go to Mama Ebere shop. Okay. She's the daughter of um, late Mazio Keke, the village headmaster. You know him now. Ooh, 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 ooh. Village headmaster? Yes, Papa. <laughs> I know him very well. Oh, good. Oh, she must be from a good family. Oh, wonderful. Let her come and see me. Bring her to me. It's all right, Papa. That's not a problem. I would inform her and then bring her to you. Yes. And uh, I have a packet for you. Once you get married, eh? I will hand all my properties over to you. In the city and the, all the undeveloped lands, you will start collecting the rent from all the houses I built in the city. Wow. And you will become a, a, a landlord already. <laughs> Not a caretaker, a landlord straight. Eh? That will help you and your wife to stand Break it there. Eh? 
Thank and, you, Papa. And uh, soon you will become a man. Ah, Papa, I'm already a man now. <laughs> <laughs> no, you are not yet a man. It is marriage that defines who is a man and who is a boy. Papa, eh? I've grown beards, so. oh <laughs> <laughs> That beard means nothing. Mm. Until you marry, that's where you begin to grow. You learn how to be with a woman, and uh, also uh, your children begin to say, ah, daddy, daddy, daddy. You have become a man. Eh, hey. go and get me water to drink. It's all right, Papa. Nice. Okay, um, I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hey. Mm -hmm. hey. Where are you going? Where is the lucky girl? Ha. Did I mention any lucky girl to you? Did I say I was getting married to any lucky girl? Obina, why are you doing like this now? Eh? Am I not your G? I heard you talking with Papa now. Yeah, I see. Don't worry. Um, Papa asked me to get water for him. So let me just go and get the water. When I get back, I will just you. Come now. Uh -uh. Tell me now, Bo. Don't bring any girl to this compound. Yeah. That has you see your problem. That. I know you are eager to hear the full gist. But relax. When I go in there, get the water for Papa. Then I will come back and gist you. Uh -huh. Can't you calm down? Relax. I don't see your bloody hot. Just you. Should I help you with the water? Don't worry. I, I can walk up, oh. Let me help you. Who is the lucky girl? See, Ubina, we are the only sisters you have in this world. In fact, we are your bro brothers, we are your sisters. So tell us the girl. Let's know if she's a good girl. Let's do our own secret findings. But both of you already know my girlfriend now. Ngozi. Uh -uh. You uh -huh. had a girlfriend. I don't yeah. know. Did you know? I don't know. Ngozi now, the daughter of the late village master. You know her now. Oh, Ngozi. Oh, Ngozi. Ngozi mm. is a fine girl. Ngozi is a good girl. Your brother. I like her. What did Papa say about it? Well, Papa accepted. I mean. You know, um, just that like he said I should bring her to him. Papa is yeah. right. You know, Papa is educated, so he would like to know more about her. Uh, in that case, I would have to inform Ngozi about it, you know. Um, tell her that um, she needs to fix a date to come and see my family. This <laughs> one is small. So, like this now, you soon get married. Hope if you get married, you stop playing this area. Because enough of all this, I will just beg. Did you guys cook anything? I am hungry. Please give me something to eat now. Hmm? Don't worry, I will get you something to eat, boy. Very soon, your wife will be the one cooking for you. <laughs> I mean, like, make a job first. Make a job first before facing this marriage. So at least I can have strength to face the marriage. Oh, it's mm -hmm. food for me. Hey, hey, girl, but you know me, I don't like so that. <laughs> I'll get food get for food you. For Relax. <laughs> but that's your wife now. Eh? Can she cook a goose? You, can you cook? Can you cook a goose? <laughs> What of abacha? Can she make abacha? She With can make food. abacha very well now. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, one that is from this community. Yeah. She even knows how to make abacha more than you. I sure she's the true daughter. Like, are, are you not it. looking at me? Are you no. not seeing the way I'm, 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 I'm looking nice and fresh? I'm not seeing you. What <laughs> you can cook, so you will not lose weight, too. Yeah. Am I losing weight like this? Eh, hey, you're not losing now. You know all this while I've been going out. I've been eating gossip food. I this said it too. Looking plumpy. I said it. That's why here is dark. Here is dark. Here yeah. is fair. Don't go this like she cannot cook. Oh. Okay, like see, see what will happen. Tell her if she's coming to see Papa, she should bring her pacha with fish. Let's test. Or oh, you are the one who is supposed to cook something for the visitor that is coming. No, no, as well, no, 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 no. she's supposed to cook and bring for her family mm. members to buy our love. In those as days, a, eh? As an audition. She's coming to audition for how to how to cook. In those days, she's supposed to even come and live with us for like two weeks. No, she's a good white material. It's like you're still learning your brother. If Ngozi comes here and spends two, two, two weeks. Get her pregnant. Hey, if you get her pregnant, she'll be born now. Let's know if she'll give birth to a girl. Don't use this your earring and open the girl's ear. Hey, wo, before Papa will say she's wayward, that she got pregnant before wedlock.
um, greetings, Papa. Um, I hope I didn't disturb your sleep. Then I can do. I didn't master. Uh, I was, I was dreaming. <laughs> anyway, um, I want to go and see Ngozi. Okay, it's all right. It's all right. Uh, don't forget to tell her that I want to see her. It's all right. I would. I would defend her. I will do just that. Uh. Um, baby, see. Yeah. I have told my father and my sisters about you, mm? and they are very, very happy about it. Mm. As a matter of fact, they are eager to meet you. Serious? Mm -hmm. But the thing is, you have to wait for me. When I let you, you know, inform you, you come. I'm mm? so happy, my love. I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm happy too. <laughs> I'm so happy. Emma, and I was yeah. even thinking they won't accept me. Ah, my family will accept you as long as you are from a good family, they will accept you. <laughs> I'm telling you. But please, baby, you have to do this thing for me. Mm? Before you come to our house, please, it is very, very important. Before you answer any question, think about it first. Hmm? Because my father is very wise and educated. Ah, yes. My love, are you forgotten why? Have you forgotten that my late father was the village headmaster? Oh, that's true. Ah, I almost forgot. Yeah. Oh, I love you. I love you more. And I will always stand by you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I need mean to. <laughs> um, baby, yeah. I I like to take you out this afternoon. Yeah, and I'll be glad to walk by your side to get those parts. Oh, yeah. Those are very good. And hey, do you know that our brother Obina has finally found the girl he will get married to? Yes. Really? Mm -hmm. Please, who is the lucky girl? Ah. Ngozi, the late headmaster's daughter. Hey, I know Ngozi very well. She's very beautiful. And she's fair in complexion. Your brother has eyes for good things. She's a very beautiful, fine girl. Hmm. Knowing you girls. And knowing how much you love your brother. I'm sure you must have gone to spy on that innocent girl. <laughs> You know us very well. We've not done that, but we are planning to do it. Yes, mm -hmm. so we will not allow an anyhow girl into our home. So don't worry. We will investigate her and make sure she has nothing in her cupboard. Won't you come with us? Here. In our gym, won't I come? <laughs> I what trust am I doing? You <laughs> I trust you. <laughs> of course I will come. What do you have to say about this marriage proposal of Robin and our sister, Ngozi? Um, Ngozi told me about it yesterday and I was so happy for her. If she loves uh, Obina, she can go on with the marriage. We have to meet our pastor to pray about it. I'm not feeling well about this marriage. Pastor, what? Must we meet pastor in everything we do in this family? His prayer control is physical. We need to greet him and pray about it. Sister C, leave him alone. Everything about you now is prayer, 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 prayer. Small time now, if you want to eat, you can call Pastor to come and pray for us. If Pastor did not come, we will not eat. Hmm. I have said my own no. Leave him. Okay. Leave him. Hey, sister, mm. where have you been? I'm very hungry. Oh. Sister, do you even know how to do any other thing in this house except eating? Anyway, I'm coming back from Ujo and Nkechi's place. Guess what? Guess what? Please, please say anything that you want to say. I don't have strength for guessing. Hmm. I will still tell you what I want to tell you anyway. Do you know that Nkechi and Ujo's brother Obina has finally found a girl he wants to get married to? Mm -hmm. Sister, who is she? Ngozi now, Ngozi the late headmaster's yes. daughter. 
That girl is so beautiful. So I'm not even surprised she caught Obina's attention. What's the meaning of that? Sister, you're not a girl. You have been friends with Uju and Nkechi since childhood. Yeah, they did not find you good enough for their brother. <laughs> Look at Uchechi, yo. Uchechi, have I ever told you that I'm interested in getting married to Obina? Wherever, I don't need anybody to tell you. Or oh, don't you need a husband? Nedi King, I can't call. If I'm going to post, I'm not going to be able to get one. I got the one. You don't have respect like for me. Who should respect? Respect to Jugisi. Look at this girl, oh. Better go and find something I will eat you. And you are not interested in not being now. You will still remain single. Very soon I will get married and no, leave you alone with this couple. I'm not going to get married. No, come on, come you can wait for me. me. My dear, I'll be visiting his family tomorrow. Eh, my friend, please dress well so that his father will not see anything to say about you. Uh, uh, of course, you know I'll dress well. I'm, I bought a new dress yesterday. Mm -hmm. I'm ready for them. Hey, I trust you. I know what you can do, my <laughs> friend. Ah, thank you. Eh, hey, guess what? What? Guess now. What now? You know, I'm, guess. I'm not good at guessing. My love Obina told me that our marriage will kick off next month. Eh? That's if his father approves it. Eh? Yes. Oh, my friend, I'm so happy for you. Please <laughs> add me to your shape. <laughs> uh, why not? Uh, you're sounding as if you don't know me again. If I don't add you, who else will I add? Mm. You're my best friend. Ah, I you're trust among you. my girls. <laughs> my friend, I'm trust. I'm so happy for you. Thank you. So Thank I you. can't wait for that special day to Thank come. Thank you. I can't Thank wait. That day will be a day of joy. <laughs> and if know. you see me, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know. Mm. Hey, let me show you the dress. Come, come in for Let's go inside. Let me show you. Mm. Hey, let me show you the dress. Ah, Papa. Nozi is coming today to see you. Ooh, she's coming. Yes, Papa. Eh? Hey? I will also be waiting to see her. But have you informed your sisters about her coming so that the Ghanis listen she got us go? <laughs> they know about her coming. Uh, yes. As a matter of fact, I told them even before coming out here. Okay. As I'm talking to you, Papa, uh, they are in the kitchen preparing, preparing jello it. fries. Uh, <laughs> you know what? Uh, go inside the house. You will see my wallet on my box. Collect uh, money from me. Go and buy some drinks so that you entertain her. Eh? Eh? Papa, you are you are you are more happy about uh, Ngozi's coming more than you. <laughs> Why can't I be happy? Why can't I be happy? Uh, what time did she say that she's coming? Oh, um, we agreed on um, twelve noon. It is almost twelve o'clock. Oh, is it? It's true. Eh? Let me just hurry. Yes. I remember my own. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Papa, um, what would you like to take? Uh, snap, snap. Oh. All right. Your, your favorite. <laughs> <laughs> my daughter in law to be. Oh, she's coming. <sighs>
ne mana me kene giyo onu mojuru ekene hebi merendo foromo onu mojuru ekene ada me kene giyo onu mojuru ekene hebi merendo Ngozi is dead. I don't understand. I saw her body lying on the road that reached the market square. Chima! 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 Ngozi is dead. I don't know. What is it? Obila, Obila, is dead. Stop that. If you, if it's a joke, stop it. What kind of expensive joke is that now? Obila, I'm not joking with you. Ngozi is dead. On my way coming back, I saw people gathered. I went there to see what was happening. I saw her dead body on the floor. You are pranking me. Obila, I'm no, talking to you now. Come, you are pranking me. Where did you hang? Where did you keep the camera? I did not give any camera anywhere. Obila, they are taking her body to her father's compound now. She is dead. Ngozi is dead. Ngozi is dead. Let me go, let me go to him, you see? Hey, oh, hey, It's me, Obina. Talk to me. Please talk to me now. Talk to me. Remember, we're supposed to get married. <laughs> Baby. Be nice, it's me. It's me, your love, it's me. Gozi, <laughs> Gozi, don't do this to me, please. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! Is your brother will be now coping with Ngozi's death? No, he's not coping, no. he's not coping at all. Can you believe that for the past one week I've not set my eyes on my brother? He even locked himself up in his room, he has refused to eat or drink. He stopped talking to me and the kitchen. I can understand his pain, I really feel for him. I also feel for him, but I don't want him to fall sick out of grief. Drew, this is the best time 
that he needs your support, your love and understanding. What he is passing through now are all stages of grief. And soon, he will come to accept his reality. Okay. You should accept, though. You should accept the reality fast, fast. Because me, I miss my best friend. My brother is my best friend. And I miss him. The worst part is that nobody knows what killed him because he... It surprises me, too, that in this, our small community, someone could just die like that and nobody knows or even saw what happened to her. Mm. Only God and Ngozi knows. But unfortunately, Ngozi is not here to tell us what killed her. The dead do not speak. Are you going anywhere? No, I'm just standing outside this gate holding this eye. Hey. Yeah. But I could try. So will you eat? I will eat though, but it's not that this one all of you are grieving. I don't know. But I will eat, I'm hungry. Eh, hey, you will eat, you cannot say no. We are grieving. You know you, you know we are grieving, but you still want to eat our eyes. <laughs> Please be you want it, you want the food to spoil. <laughs> I hope the photo you are eating rice. If you I'll give you. Eh, hey, give me smile. Good day, sister. Uh -huh. Which age? Uh, How are sister? you? I'm fine. Uh, sister, I'm not visiting your friends today. <laughs> Which age? Yeah. That house has turned into a house of money. The last time I went there, everybody has a sad face. Even the food they gave me, said I could not even digest the food. So, I just want to give them space for now. Let them mourn in peace. Hey, sister. Hmm? I thought you have sense. Let them know you don't need Huh? Sister, when did this one start? Are you calling me a stupid person or what? Sister, it's not that I'm calling you stupid. Don't you know this is your opportunity? Opportunity for what? Sister, opportunity for you to go and take place in Nobina's house. Now that Ngozi is dead, you're supposed to be going to the house every day, keeping a house choice, getting close to Obina. Sister, before you know it, Obina will fall in love with you. <laughs> ha! Informer. There is nothing you will not see in this life. What you achieve? Sister, I have warned you before. I am not interested in getting married to Obina. My own man will come. Do you understand? Is the gate locked? Yeah. Oh. Uh -huh. Sister, if you love Obina so much, Biko, the door is wide open for you. Go to Obina's house and try your luck. Do you understand? I don't want to get angry with you this morning. Biko, get out. Sister, you're getting old though. Get the old girl. Go and get married. Go get out of this place. Look at me, I'm best I will get married. I need you to in this house. You don't, you don't have it. You don't have it. You don't have it. Look at Hey! See me see problem, oh. I don't blame you. If mama I, I blame for spoiling you. Stupid girl. Can you imagine Uchi Echi? I should go and get married. This girl doesn't have respect anymore. Obina, Papa, you know it's almost one year since we lost on Gossip. I'm aware. For how long shall we continue to wait till you get someone else to take her place in this house? Um, actually, Papa, I I've already had this conversation with my sisters yesterday. You know, and um, I gave them my word that I was going to bring someone home. But now that we're having this conversation again, I I'm giving you my word for the second time. Very soon, I will bring a girl home. And that girl must be from this town. Because I married your mother from this town. Okay. And we want my son to marry from this town. It's okay, Papa. I will do as you just said. Uh -huh. I uh, heard that uh, some tenants have started paying their rent. Oh, really? Because I noticed some alerts coming in. And, uh, 
to confirm it. So I, I will want you to take my ATM, go to the bank and withdraw some money. Okay, I will do just that. Um, which of your ATM cards am I to take? Is it your access bank card or your standby card? Take both of them. It's all right. So uh, how much am I withdrawing? Withdraw 50,000 first. My name is Adolisa. Adolisa? And that was how I met her. Yeah. Hmm. Have you told Papa about it? Not yet. Where is she from? Uh, actually, Ada is from this village. Yeah. But her both parents are late. Ah. Yeah. Currently, she stays in the city with her uncle. Yeah. All these city girls. But uh, Ubina, do you really like her? Likeness is an understatement. Mm. I am in love with her. <laughs> I am truly in love with her, Aww. Lover Love her boy. Love one thing, thing. Okay, I don't want it. <laughs> no, please, for the last time. Take. <laughs> mm. Mm. This is nice, right? Very sweet. I'll try this one. You buy from? From the village market. Do you know what they call this? I'm going to orange. Orange love. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, orange of love. Orange love. Okay, this is a this sign is of orange. your love. Mm -mm, this is not a sign of Okay, yes. Something like that. Sign of my love. Mm. Orange is sweet now, so my love is actually sweet. Mm. Not bitter. Huh? My own too is sweet. <laughs> Sweeter mm. than yours. I'll test it first now. Maybe when you become my wife. Yeah. Mm. And I know how it <laughs> tastes. So you, 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 you don't know how sweet my love is yet? How would I know? Yeah, you give me. I mean, you give sense. You give me. You're not romantic, we <laughs> It's time for you to test my love. Mm, mm, mm. Your love is indeed sweet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I told you, mine is sweeter. Yours, yours is sweeter. Or oh, mine is sweeter than yours. Say life. Ah, yeah. Test again. Father, mm. mm. I'm finishing this one. For the love of um, orange. Mm. Mm. No reason, can. Ah, you know what Okay. This person that made your hair should be very tight. Mm. Mm. She's not that woman at, at some poor market. No. Mm. So she wants to enjoy you for me. Because I paid her small money. Next time, I want to make your head come so I can give you enough money to pay her. Oh. Yeah. Before she go, she go use, you know, the fact that she didn't pay her well to enjoy you. Let me come. Oh. Yes. 
Papa, I... I have to be sincere with you. I love her. And I would love to make her my wife. <laughs> As you say so, it's okay but till I see her. Well, Papa, I would inform her about it. You didn't even ask me where she's from, but I'll tell you. She's from this village, mm -hmm. just like you want it. But, um, Papa, her parents are late. Oh. Yes. Oh. Uh, but, um, she stays with her uncle currently mm. in the city. Oh, oh sorry. Well, no problem. Did I see her? It's okay. Yeah. I, I would inform her about that. It's okay, uh, my dear. Yes, um, let me go and join my sisters inside. It's okay. It's all right. Baby? Yes. My father and my sisters would like to meet you. Meet me? Why? Who all this work? Yeah, all is fine. I mean, I I told them about you and um, they were happy. And they said I should bring you home. <laughs> Are you serious? Yes. I mean, why would you tell them about me without informing me first? Oh, I'm sorry I didn't inform you first. But, um, I mean, they all know about you now. In fact, let me just be straight with you. Hmm? I told my father that I'd like to marry you. And um, he was cool with it, he was happy about it. <laughs> I haven't been straight with you, so I, um, I, I, I should make it official now. Hmm? Because I know if I say, be my wife, you won't say no. Hmm? <laughs> Definitely, because we love each other, right? Yes. All right, um, let's do this officially. Will you be my wife? Will you marry me? Of course I will. Ah, thank you so much. Oh. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> I can't wait to make you my wife. I love you so much. And I want to Nkechi, how are you? And how is your brother Obina? I'm fine, and my brother Obina is fine too. Since my sister's dead, I have not seen any of you. And I have something to discuss with you. Uh, what is that? After my sister's death, I went to our pastor for prayers. And he said that the cause of my sister's death is from your family. There is it. What is the meaning of this now? See, you and your fake pastor should stay away from I and my family. See, Nkechi, he even told me to tell you people to be prayerful because death is roaming around your family. God forbid, it's you and your family that is roaming around. See, you and your sister should go and pray for yourselves. I'm going. Nkechi, Nkechi, you have to listen to me, oh. Think of it. Up till now, nobody knows what killed Ngozi. I heard her brother went to a pastor and he told him that the cause of Ngozi's death is from our family. Holy Ghost Fire, our family. All these pastors and their fake prophecies, all they want is to bring enmity between us and Ngozi's family. How do you know all this? I met Eze on the road and he told me everything. He also said we should be careful and pray hard. Oh, in the prayer warriors, why didn't they pray when their sister was still alive? Oh. Now she's dead, they know they will start praying. Well, I thank God she didn't die after getting married to Obi now. I thank God she died before entering our family. We don't have money for burial. <laughs> Maybe Obi now will sell his sandals now. Bury her. Where is he, safe? I don't know. Ngozi. Ngozi. 
What are you doing here? Obina. Ngozi, I have looked for you everywhere. Where have you been? Obina, my love. Not all that glitters are good. Ngozi, come. Ngozi! 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 Obina! Ngozi! Ngozi, what? Obina. I saw Ngozi in my dreams. Obina. Ngozi is dead. And the dead have nothing to do with the living. You have to come and eat. Food is ready. I see my Ngozi. Come and eat, oh. I'm coming. All that glitters is not gold. Don't this out the food for me. Good day, Obina. Okamaka, how are you doing? I'm fine. Um, I had a bad dream about you yesterday. Yeah. Bad dream, Okwa? Yes. Uh, what is this dream of yours all about? Well, I can't remember. But just be strong in prayer. Okamaka, we all know that you're a very strong prayer warrior. Right? Feel free to put me in your prayers. But as for now, I was on my way to meet someone very, very important. <laughs> Thank you for your advice. Hmm. Hmm. This generation perish because of lack of knowledge. Hmm. May the Lord have mercy on you. <laughs> Uju, Ukechi, I've been meaning to ask you girls something. What is it? Your face looks serious. It's about the girl your brother opened and intends to get married to. Uh, what about her? Like, what do you girls really know about this girl? Like, who are her parents, her siblings? Any information? Do you have any information at all about her? Well, our brother said she came back from the city, but her parents are dead. Even if her parents are dead, who are her parents? Do you, do, does any of you know who her mother or her father is? Her uncle, the one she said she's staying in the city with. If hey, woman, are you looking for your uncle? Eh? Is any of your uncles missing? Or is any of your family relatives missing? What was your problem with our uncle? We don't know who our uncle is. When our brother brings her to the house, we will ask her. Don't worry. We will ask her. These questions are very important. Anyway, why I'm saying this is that the other day, I met her with your brother on the road. And there is something about that girl that I don't like. I smell jealous in you. Wait, do. If you are don't tell me you are crushing on our fine brother. Hey. Will you shut up? You are even beginning to sound like my sister Uchechi. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why didn't you tell us some time? Let's connect you and our brother now. Since you like Please, 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 stop. I am not crushing on your brother. Mm -hmm. And I am not jealous of anybody. But I think this is the time we need to go and do that investigation we were supposed to do, do before with Nkozi. Oh, 
See, I know your brother is an only son. But he shouldn't be in a hurry to get married to just any girl. As far as Obina likes her, I don't have a problem with her. Oh, if Omar, when people want to do investigation as DPO and uh, Inspector General, as long as I give you my blessings, people can go. I well, me, start. I can't wait for my brother to get married so that the wife will be the one doing all the, all the house chores. Me, mm -hmm. I'm tired. Like pounding yam now, uh -huh. pounded the jam. Yeah. You girls are not even serious. I am talking about something very important and you're talking about house chores. Is a brother getting married to a housemaid? Uh, whatever. Here. This one you're saying now is important to you. The one we are saying mm, is important, important to us. It's important to us. Here. So everybody you have your own importance. Mm. Uh. Yes, Adana. We're supposed to meet here by 12. Ah. And uh, we're running out of time. What's all this now? No, I'm supposed to have met here by now. Hmm? And my people are worried. I'm very, very sure about that. I'm supposed to meet here by, by 12. Come on. Where is she? Agreement is supposed to be agreement. We agreed we're supposed to meet here. She was to ah. Ada. Ah. I, I, I've been waiting for you. I, we agreed we were supposed to meet here by 12. Check your time. Oh, it's, it's 12 already. But, but how did you get here? I mean, I have been... Um... I, I came in from that way. Remember you were looking that side when I came Ah, that's true. That's true. And But um, my people are already with him. I'm sure by now they'll be worried. Please, let's go now. This is Ado Lisa. She's the girl I've been telling you about. You're yeah, welcome, my daughter. Thank you so much, Papa. So, where are you from? Papa, I'm from this village. Hmm. Um, my parents died when I was five years old. Oh. So, since then, I have been living with my uncle in the city. I just came back three months ago. Hey, hey, hey. You, you've been living in your father's house alone? Yes, Papa. Hey, hey, hey. Anyway, my son, Ovina, has told me so many things about you. Hmm? But I would like to hear from your uncle also. Eh? Um, no problem, Papa. I'll give Obina his number so you can talk to him. Uh, it's all right. It's okay. It's all right. Obina. Papa. You have to take her to your sister's. All right. Hey. Do just that. You're welcome, my daughter. Thank you, Papa. Oh. Oh, yeah. Let me take you to my sister's. Uh, Adulisa, these are my sisters. Hmm? Okay. This is Adulisa. She's the girl I've been telling you both about. Oh, she's so beautiful. I, I have eyes for good things now. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you so much. Ah. Uh -uh. Obina, leave us. No, I want to have girls talk. Uh -uh. Are you guys chasing me out? Uh, yes. Go. Okay. Well, in that case, I I would be over there with Papa. Uh, okay, my love. Yes. What's What's my love? love? <laughs> you are jealous, Adi. I know you. Are, you are both be jealous. jealous. I'm not jealous. <laughs> Don't you mind her. You guys, uh, you guys should keep her company very well. Taking care of her. Okay. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Hey, tell us about the city. Mm. Mm. The city. Mm. It's actually a very, very fine place. Just be big cast. Eh, uh, Papa, Adolisa is going home. We'd like to escort her. Eh, uh, but it's very nice here to do that. I want now. I'm um, don't worry, Papa. I would like them to escort me. I'll see you in a later. Eh. So you both have connived, eh? You connived with my wife. You want to take my wife away? Okay. Oh, yeah? yeah? Yes, so Papa, eh? don't worry. We'll be back soon, yeah? Uh, eh? <laughs> and you what is what is between you? 
I'm just shaking your body like a like a dog that they give bone. <laughs> I'm happy now. You're happy. Yeah. <laughs> um, Papa, I want to thank you so much for your hospitality. Thank you so much for everything you've done for me. You are welcome, my daughter. <laughs> my <laughs> darling daughter. <laughs> you are welcome. Um, I'll, I'll be on my way now. Let's go. One, oh yeah, I have handed her over to you both. Take. My sister. Yes, yes, yes. Ah. shall visit the children. Hello, Lisa. Silence, Mazio Keke. Your sins have come to haunt you. You remember what you did 40 years ago? me in that forest without helping me. Forgive me. I cried for three days before I died in pain. I, 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 I. Now I have come to destroy you and your generations and anything that makes you happy. Ah! Ah! 